Waco police are issuing a warning tonight after an alarming spike in counterfeit money. Now police and Secret Service are teaming up to try and crack down on the fake cash. Channel 6 News reporter Chris Rogers joins us now with all the details. Hey Chris. Hey Doug Leslie. As technology continues to grow, so does the number of ways scammers are duping people into taking counterfeit money. Now law enforcement is fighting back and warning you what to look out for. It's a growing problem that is taking the money out of the hands of consumers and business owners alike. Central Texas has seen an alarming rise in the number of counterfeit dollars finding their way into circulation. Scott DeFord is the resident agent in charge for the United States Secret Service. Part of his job is cracking down on counterfeit money. We claim eight, over $82,000 in counterfeit, and, and that is estimated a very small amount of counterfeit that's floating around in, in our 13 county. Area. That's up from an average of about 60 to 70,000 in previous years. The problem is it's a hard crime to crack down on as money changes hands quickly and most of the time unknowing customers become victim. And they'll go out and sell an item to somebody and take counterfeit not knowing that it's counterfeit money. So there's different ways they're getting this into circulation. And even when the fake cash is discovered, it's even harder to track down the criminal making it. Not a easy, it's not an easy crime to, uh, to prove. Uh, so it, that's why it's so, still so prevalent today. But there are a couple ways to spot a phony bill. The Secret Service says a lot of counterfeit bills have for motion picture use only or Chinese writing printed on the note. You can also hold it up to the light to check for a watermark or security threat. But an increasing number of counterfeiters are becoming more savvy, finding ways to get around the simple checks. Often they'll whitewash a small bill and reprint 50s or 100s on top. But so when you look it up there, you know, you got to say, OK, well, here's Benjamin Franklin, but is that Benjamin Franklin or is that Abraham Lincoln? And counterfeiting isn't just common. It's downright easy. They're, the ease of the equipment to do it is there. And, and it's readily accessible to all of us at a local electronic store. With a growing number of bills making their way into the mainstream marketplace in Central Texas, law enforcement is warning residents to remain vigilant when handling cash. Now, Doug, Leslie, one of the most sure-proof ways to check if your cash is legit is looking for color-shifting ink and tilting the bill at a 45-degree angle. If it's real currency, this color strip right here will change from copper to green. Doug, I'll give this right back to you. Back to you guys. <laughs> And Chris, I will give you your car keys as soon as you <laughs> give that back to me. He thinks I'm kidding.